Today's 23rd. It's written all right in front. So um, in this example, ladies and gentlemen, we have the fourth root of negative 64. Now, there's something that's very, very important that I want to get to. Before even thinking about the numbers, all right, um, if you guys remember, when we were looking into square roots, we could not take the square root of a negative number, right? Because we knew that there's no number multiplied by itself is going to give you a negative number. Well, the same thing is going to occur, ladies and gentlemen, when we have an even root. So if we have the fourth root, if we have the fifth root, the sixth root, or the hundred and second root, any time you have an even root, you cannot, take the, you cannot take the root of a negative number. Okay, So this one is just going to be um, what we just say is cannot be simplified. Now, we could use the imaginary, imaginary system. Okay, now we could obviously simplify the, the fourth root of 64, but we're not going to be able to um, simplify the fourth root of negative 64 unless we go ahead and use our imaginary number system, which we're not going to be concerned about for this chapter.